actually this whole goal, aspirational goal towards 2034 is very much dominated by the men's game and which shouldn't be the case. It should actually be towards growing football between, I mean, not just uh, among the men, but among the women, because the one thing which we have done, which isn't getting much result is, the, is basically pumping money towards the men's game. But are we pumping enough money towards the women's game? I had um, one of the club, uh, one of the women's clubs, um, um, one of the one of the, one of the coaches from one of the women's clubs, playing in the women's league, um, actually messaged me and said they get no funding from the FAS at all, whereas the Singapore Football League, which is the NFL clubs, um, they get financial support. Uh, there's a grant for them. I mean, the SPL teams do get grants, but the women's clubs don't get any grants. So, I mean, is that fair? So, my, so you're right in the sense that I think more should be done to develop the women's game because it's, an, it's really uncharted territory. You know, you will never know whether or not that could be where your, your glory comes, comes up from because, you see, the women do not have issues of national service to grapple with. We, the men do, right? And if you think about investment and you talk about equality, you talk about uh, if equality is something which the government is really condo are trying to push for, then you gotta, why is it aspirational towards 2034, which is the men's World Cup? I don't get that. Mm -hmm.